Hello everybody and welcome back to another Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. episode. This is season 4, episode 4. Let me stand next to you. <laughs> Let me stand next to your fire. Can one really put a dollar amount on the perfect home? Yes, one can. And we oh my god, they're going to move in together. Shame. Take lots of pictures. You've got it. Plenty of pictures. And good oh luck. Oh my god. Love you. Yep. <laughs> Yeah, of course, something bad has to happen. Hello. I'm pretty sure they make a lot of money. This building yes. does not look that expensive, so why? I mean, between the two of them could pay something really nice. Not an apartment, maybe like a little house or something. She's fucking ready. Oh my god, I love her. I love her so much. <laughs> What the fuck? Like you is why I'm in here. But there's a chance, if you help me, that I can help you get out of here. Oh, great. Of course. Serious? Oh my god! I don't know what the fuck is wrong with Netflix lately. Could be my laptop, but it's always only with Netflix. And it also happens on a PlayStation 3. For seven minutes in order to reboot your central nervous system. You did what? Well, <laughs> in order to quell the hyperactivity in your reticular activating system, we had to very carefully, gently kill you. Just a little bit. <laughs> As I came Indeed. back. You can trust me with your life, Agent May. Oh God, I'm scared of her. Okay. I took this bullet out. Did an awful job. Things with Fitz must be going well. Yeah. E and together we'll put it. Take mandatory lie detection tests. I can't just voluntarily aid a wanted vigilante. Girl. What if it wasn't voluntary? She would've shit you, though. I've missed you, too. Momentum lap? Yeah, get in the car, I'm driving. Oh, hell no. Oh, no. <laughs> well, of course not, but... Don't follow him! <laughs> to get in the car, I'm driving. Oh, hell no. <laughs> Wait, but Daisy drove Lola. Is Lola a match for this bad boy? I mean, the car. It looks pretty... Okay, I'm excited about the episode and all, but I just made an appointment to cut my hair and I don't know why I'm having the worst panic attack ever, like anxiety or something, like I can't fucking breathe. <laughs> Mixed with the hype for the episode, I think I'm dying. I don't take change. Well, so changing my hair, changing it to this color was freaking hard, like every single small change that I do to myself makes me so anxious and I know I have tattoos and all but like it doesn't get better I just get so anxious I need to stop thinking about my hair for a second and just concentrate in the episode what do you wait? so I guess Lola is a match the way that you're driving so let me take the wheel my car I drive you wouldn't fit behind the wheel anyway <laughs> too tall he is actually way too big Go Lola! I mean, Lola fucking flies! Can you show him a little bit of your baby? Let me fix the flight functionality in this thing. Don't worry, it's not gonna be a problem this time. What? It doesn't fly anymore? It does? What happened? Technically, a shield special advisor in science and technology, she works for me. <laughs> I'm nervous my eyes would all bug out and I'd lose my breath. You lost your breath. She's out, why, why, why would she be out? You're right, your eyes do all bug out when you get nervous. <laughs> you can't have it both ways, Daisy. 
You can't push us away and then come crawling back half dead only when you feel like it. It isn't fair. You can't mm -hmm. really put a gun to my head. We're in this together now. So suck it up. Ha! <laughs> oh yes, I love their change. Fitz and Simmons, they've grown so much. I love, <laughs> I love the people they became. This contained a lot more dangerous people than you. Lash, for example. You said Daisy trusted you. Yeah, maybe. Huh. Why? Why? What are you thinking? Because if she trusts him, we trust him, right? What the hell are you doing? I think it's time I make a deal with the devil myself. Ooh. You know what that feels like, don't you? Aww. Shield is here to help you move on, James. Or you can take a stand with me. Fight back. That's how you move on. You can't fight back. She's totally broken on the inside, and I mean literally, her bones are broken. Let's try your improvements before we release you. So cold heat. Excuse me? Agent May says you can shove all your tests up your ass. <laughs> I don't want you involved with any of this. Coulson. Well, a little late for that. We gotta move. Deal. We got a situation with an ass. She's gonna drive him crazy too. No. May I ask you a question? Of course, ask me anything. Oh no, she's creating a conscience. about where I'm from. It's okay to lie to shield people. From Is that fear where I, what I see in her face? Cause I don't like this. Don't fall for it. Oh my God, she's she has a conscience and she has feelings. James and this is bad. No, I don't trust him for a reason. I don't like this. Maybe doing some good will make you feel better. I think it might. Yeah. Mm-mm. Look at that face. I don't trust him. Oh my god. Put your hands up! The watchdogs aren't my enemy. What? You gave them access to your watch. Let them hijack the signal. Oh, I so knew it. Someone had to... How could they you do them? this to me? You're the one that turned me into this freak of nature. You were obsessed with going through Terragenesis. What an asshole. And I'm going to be the last one to go. I don't hate myself. I hate all of us. <laughs> me. <laughs> oh, no. This is going to be fun. Oh, my God. She's hurt. Come on. And Simmons, she's a badass now, but the... That bad as I mean, there are too many. Oh no. Mm. Guess who was on fire too? Hello, baby. But you just made a big mistake. Oh, Funny. really? It's gonna say the same thing without the accent. Robbie? <laughs> Robbie is definitely stronger than this guy, I'm sure. I mean, he can't die, he can't break, he can't get hurt, he can't nothing. I still don't understand this power. I don't remember the old movies. But he is hella stronger. Goodbye. Oh, hello. Are you sure? Oh god. Oh, okay, I have a new love of my life. It's not taking Fitz's place, of course. But Robbie. Shit alive, right? Mm. Nothing else to say. I'm just glad you're safe. Daddy! It's not how we work here at Shield. We work together to keep everything. That's exactly why she's not in Shield anymore. Lift. Oh shit, Ada! It's good to see you back in fighting form. How long have you been lending a hand to our friend Dr. Radcliffe? Since he gave me hands. Oh my god. I'm a fellow amputee. What happened, if you don't mind me asking? Oh my god. I've actually been this way since birth. Thank God for Dr. Radcliffe and Dr. Fitz's work. Couldn't agree more. <laughs> she already she knows. Been spending so much time here. What? A cute girl. Oh, she's jealous. She's beautiful. Is she? 
Oh, yeah, she's all right, I guess. I prefer a classical beat myself. She's so real. Her, her conversational response is a range of motion. Those are weird things to say about a person. Fitz, she's an android. Of course she knows. You do know she's an android, yeah, right? Of course I know that she's an android. Fitzsimmons is moving in together. Can we just take a moment to appreciate the fast, the, well, fast, they've been friends for like 10 years. The relationship is going, can we just love them? I was gonna say that for the watchdogs to be hacking into S.H.I.E.L.D. They had to be getting some help from someone on the inside, but they weren't getting any help from someone on the inside. They were getting help from an inhuman who wants to kill his own kind. He was obsessed with being an inhuman and all. Like what? Why would you turn into Lash all of a sudden? You know what I'm saying? Ugh, what an asshole if they wanted to keep him alive. I mean, I know killing is not the best choice, but... Robbie and S.H.I.E.L.D. working together, so guess who's my new baby? <laughs> As I said, nothing and no one will ever take Fitz's place in my heart. But Robbie is right next to him, okay? Because he's powerful, he's cute, he's adorable, and he's Latino. All things I love. <laughs> he is so extremely powerful. I wish he would have been with us and working with us back when Hive. Can you imagine that fight? Oh my god, I think... I think definitely Robbie would have won, right? Because, I mean, Hive was super powerful and all, but a freaking inhuman can't do shit against him. You saw how that went. Like, he totally whooped his ass. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this episode with me, and as always, I'm Sarmiana, and I'll see you in my next video. I am Peter Pan, I'll never be a man If you never wanna grow, take my hand I'll take you to Neverland